Lovely. Alright, alright, alright. Cool, cool, cool. So I'm finding myself doing a DSS tutorial for Tekken 7. But it's, it's alright, it's good. Because this is my version of the DSS. How my tactics, how I do the DSS. So, okay. So, DSS, Dragon Sand Stance. That's what it stands for. It's, it's Lowe's, um, uh, one of, one of the, uh, I'm, I'm, I, I love this stage. Nest, uh, classical stage. But it's one of those, um, you know, stances in Tekken 7. Oh, well, in, since, since Tekken 4. Now, story. I found out about DSS um, sometime after Tekken 6 came out. Before then, when I played Tekken 5 and Tekken 5 DR and Tekken 4 and stuff like that, I didn't know anything about DSS. You know, I was a scrub. <laughs> so I just used to, yeah. And I saw a guy do Shaolin kicks and then he did a cannon kick afterwards. I was like, Oh, how'd you do that? And then he sent me a message saying, yo, you, you know, you press back, forward, forward, uh, during cannon kick. And then it wasn't down the line, it, it, and it was down the line that I found out, right, that there's other moves that you can do DSS from. So, you know, and, you know, to be a, to play low at a professional level, you need to get your DSS down. You need it for combos and to make moves safer and come out quicker and etc. etc. So you need it. It's vital in low's professional gameplay. Because there's only so many times, and you and you guys have got to get your DSS down. Because there's so many times, there's only so many times when, you know, you when you can be in a. I'm talking from past experience when you're in a tournament and, you know, you're doing a winning juggle. Like if you execute this, you've won, or you know, you've won the round, the game, or the set, and you flop your DSS, and it costs you the game, the round, or the set. It's happened to me before and I've regretted it because I didn't have my DSS down perfectly. And but it can happen because no one's perfect, you know. You can't always get your DSS down. You know, you you flop it up every now and again, thinking you've executed the right when you haven't. So it does happen. But you, like I said, you need it in lose game in general. And if you don't get it down, you're the only one to blame. And you know, and I've been in that situation when it's cost me the game or the set, and I've been very disappointed in myself because it didn't come out. I've been disappointed at the game. Don't hate the player, hate the game. No, and the player as well, because technically you're the one inputting it. So, you know, there's all right. So, you know, there's certain moves that Law can do can go into DSS. You know, you got things like Shaolin kick, Shaolin kick. Yeah, you got things like junkyard, you got junkyard. You got three Shaolin kicks, and uh, you know, you got Rai rising four, and so on. And uh, Rai rising four technically. It's the hardest DSS to do, to execute from, because it's the shortest window frame, and you need to be much quicker. That's the way I see it. And uh, I've got my command history down, so you guys can see, you know, if I... Bring it, if I... You guys can see my inputs. Now, DSS... Um, people don't tell you this, but different, different DSS moves have different timings. Again, I'm, I'm not just referring to Y Rising 4 DSS, no. I'm doing all of them in general. Like, for example, you're not, like for Shaolin Kicks, you're not going to start DSS the same way. Like, if you do two Shaolin Kicks, you, you want to start back forward the, the moment the first hit, the first kick connects. But if you're doing three of them, you want to start DSS after the second hit connects. Because the, the motion of you putting the back forward. You, do, you only need that short space of time because if you do it in between, like if you start doing it a bit, a bit late, a bit earlier, you make it complicated for yourself, and then you might go into DFS, and you, and you don't mean to, even though you think you've execution, you put the execution down right, but in fact you haven't. So the way I do it, if you struggle with it, just do it a bit later, like after the second hit connect. So, alright, guys, I'm gonna show you my input in a second from my controller. It's gonna be a bit awkward for me, but I'll, I'll do my best. Okay, so. You know, um, you know, things like perfect, and you go. And in this game, in this game, uh, for some reason, Namco have removed some of his, you know, the moves that can transition into DSS. Like you can no longer do it from cannon kick. I can get why because that's that's his um power crush move. You know, it, it, it absorbs hit and. That is minus 17 on block with pushback. So I can understand why why they're taking it away from this. But things like, you know, 
Things like flip kick, you can't do it from that anymore. Gone. In Tekken Tag 2, you could. In Tekken 6, you could. But in this, you can't. Uh, fake flip into 4, you can't do it. No, it doesn't work. But in that one's fine because it, it's a safe launcher anyway. It's a safe launcher, so it's cool. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. In, in, in the previous one, I could do it and then bounce straight away. But in this one, I can't. So those are like the main ones. There's, I think there's a few others that have taken away. But things like this still remain, you know, back one, DSS, you know, you can still do it. Back one, two, DSS. Uh, sidestep two, one, DSS, or sidestep two, DSS, or sidestep uh, two, one, two, DSS. You can still do those, you know, and things like, um, you know, uh, let's say, uh, White Rising, White Rising, uh, sorry, White Rising one, DSS, you can, and, and White Rising two, one, DSS. Do the absorbing moves that like, but um yeah so all right now i'm gonna show you guys my inputs so i'm gonna get behind my camera and show you it's gonna be very very awkward for me but it's a it's a it's a, it's a risk i'm i'm willing to take to show you guys my inputs as as well as in real time on the screen as well so yeah we're going here uh where is it yeah that's that so let's go Where's the controller? So there we are. Where is it? Where's the camera? Mm. All right, so it's there. So I have to put it like this now. Hang on. Hang on, guys. Just trying to work out the best place to put this camera. So it's there. I have to put it like this so you guys can see it. Put it like this. All right, so let's go. Okay, you guys got that? Again. So you guys can see, I just all I do is I don't I don't like for the circle and X. I don't I don't do uh uh. I just slide my finger across. It comes out. That, that's how I do it. And then I just go. You guys see the input? Like that. See? Now let's let's try with uh, free shadow kicks. As you guys can see, I started a bit uh, a bit later. You guys can yeah. see. I start after the second kick connects. So whereas the first one, I, I pretty much start straight away. Oh, sorry, the first. Uh, where, whereas if it's two kicks, I just do it straight away. I just do it straight away. There you go. Now, okay, DSS full. Look. Hang on. All right, like, this is very awkward for me, guys. So I'm having trouble doing it now. Go. Come on. This is very, very uncomfortable. <laughs> That's why I'm struggling so much. But yeah, it's very, 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 very uncomfortable. So yeah. Ah. Uh. There you go. Again. Uh. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Perfect. Cannon kick, please. There you go. Legend kick. There you go. Perfect. See? That's how it's done. Now, uh, things like DSS uh, 2. DSS 2. What I do is I press, I do DSS up forward 2. Because sometimes for me, when I do DSS 2, sometimes forward 2 comes out instead. So the way I do it is, oh, and same thing with uh, DSS 1, the knockout punch with, with the legend kick or the knockout punch with dragon roll, which is the punch, the, f the fierce punch. Um, yeah, um, the way I do it is I do back, forward, forward, up, forward, 1 or back, forward, forward, up, forward, 2. That's the way I do it. So, here we go. Yeah, he's not even going to the stance right now. 
Uh, this is that. I'm telling you guys, my hands are, is my my hands are not natural right now. My arms are not natural. I'm actually struggling. You know, the veins, the 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 the, the sensors for my body. You know, <laughs> the reflex for my body is not connecting properly. So, you got that? See, it's not because this is it's not comfortable because I'm not feeling it right now. Oh, this is so awkward. Okay, hang on. Uh, come on, Lord, man. Help me out here, man. Work with me, bro. There you go. So the way I do it is I do back forward and then up, up forward. Uh, back forward, forward, and then up forward too. But uh, there you go. Like that. So you know it was instant when it says combo. When it says combo, you know. That means if the move came out perfectly, that means there was no delays. But in, in the actual match, your opponent can block it. It's not a natural combo. But in practice, you know it was instant when it says combo, when it counts as a combo. So that's how you know. But from previous games, and I think it's still in this one too, from previous, you know, Tekken 6, Tekken Tag 2, if you get a counter hit while rising 4, then uh, 2 will be guaranteed. That will be guaranteed. If you get that, that's, that's guaranteed, okay? So, um, yeah. Like that. See, hope I hope you guys can see well. One more time. Alright, that's good. Dragon roll. Do dragon roll. No, can cannon kick. Do, do cannon kick. There you go. Cannon kick. One more time. There you go. And legend kick. There you go. Okay, guys. That's the input. That's what I do. So that was very, 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 very uncomfortable for me. So, <laughs> so you guys got to see the input that, that I do. Cool. Um, yeah. So I think that's it. That's just just go your DSS down and then you'll be fine. But but like I said, the way I do like DSS up forward too. You know, DS different DSS moves, uh, di different moves that transition into the DS into DSS have different timings. So just get your execution down for different ones. Like uh, uh, this as well, DFS. You know, while rising, while rising, while rising free, while rising free. You know. Goes into DFS, so all you have to do there is just input forward again, and then do the move. So you you go, just go forward, forward, and and then forward, and then the, the, and if you're gonna do something like um, uh, something like legend kick, just press uh forward, forward plus four. Whereas if you do it from from scratch, it's back forward, forward, forward plus four, because legend kick is forward plus four on its own. So you press the but if you if you struggle with this right, what I say is match the forward match the forward as much as you can. Just match it like right. If you do something like uh like this. See, see how many times I match forward like a million times. I match it like a million times. No? See? Whereas you should be doing this. All right, hang on. That's what you should be technically doing. Ignore the, the, the last four. Technically, see, back, forward, 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 four. Ignore the, the, the last four. That's bullshit. But yeah, because Lord knows what I'm trying to do. Whereas, oh, you can do this. See how many times I match forward? Back, uh, let me do it again. Look at that. I match forward one, two, three, four, five, five times. And then with the XC if you struggle but like I said technically you should be pushing back forward 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 four or forward 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 X or three or forward 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 uh, square or one that's how you should be done and then you can start mixing up your opponent doing things like that you know things like that grab or Things like, you no know, things like, like that, or, or oh, what am I doing? Oh, what the hell? What's wrong with my combo? Oh. 
you can, you know, you can stop doing things like that, you know. Like that, things like that, yeah. If it connected, it would have came out, but yeah. Do things like... Yeah. You guys get the gist, yeah? Yeah, you get it. So that's, you know, mash. You can see the button input, man. It comes out. Just press forward, 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 forward. You got it. So originally, I was supposed to release a video yesterday. But uh, for some reason, it, I couldn't upload my video. So it was, but my next video will be a full-on lore guide. So, you know, tactics, punishers, you name it. It'll be there. Combos, okay? So I'll see you guys on my next video. Practice hard and get it down. You need it in competitive gameplay and professional gameplay. You need DSS perfection or close to. Okay, guys? Take care.